Hi everyone, this is Video Reborn. Today I'm going to introduce you the gadgets, accessories I got from Hong Kong. This gadget, I believe, when I bought it, I thought it was real, but then it turns out to be a knockoff. But then, the good side is, the knockoff actually has a different flavor, okay, uh, compared to the original one. Today I'm going to introduce you the Sector 5 replica. Okay. Well, I didn't know it until I bought it. This one cost a lot, all right. To me in the case, it's $250 Hong Kong, okay, which is around $30 a case for a case, for a bumper case. Okay. Let me tell you, okay. This thing in reality cost if this is a real one, it cost $139. Wow. I really can't believe I'm reviewing a $139 USD case. But right now, this is just a replica. So, um, well, still, I want to review it because I'm doing different kinds of gadgets hunting, cases hunting. You can check on my other videos. I got real stuff. I got replica. I don't know what's going on. I just get it. I'm just hunting for the best case. And so far, this one caught me, all right? This unboxing of the Sector 5, it's a bumper by with an aluminum material, okay? And there's a metallic flip where you can flip it open. It's nice, okay? You hear that? See? It's a nice ele um, element case. Once you open it, you get this aluminum case wrapping around the rack. Let me tell you, the real one doesn't have blue color. This is actually a replica and it doesn't really fit my iPhone tight. Okay, It has some kind of movement which I kind of scared because it's 30 bucks first of all, it's expensive to me. Uh, secondly, it's it moves around, so the iPhone has a little bit of rattling in there. So it might, if dust caught in, it will scratch your case. Okay, I mean scratch your uh, your phone, um, aluminum uh, silver edges. But I think um, there are some kind of stickers for you to uh, put on top of the iPhone five to prevent that. And I'll show it to you. All right. Um, this is a screw. Um, model with uh, eight screws at eight different corners okay and the screws are the metric screws with hexagonal shapes as you can see I don't know about the real one the real one I think it's it's a different type of screw but uh, correct me um, in the comment please and uh, the hinges you can actually, uh, if you buy several different ones, you can actually change the colors of these aluminum um, edges. And let just let let me tell you, it has the uh, element case printed over here. It's not laser edge, not like the real one. And then there's the uh, element logo over here, which looks very pretty much like the real one. Correct me if you want to. And over here, it even has the uh, Sector First Edition uh, logo printed over here. It says made in the U.S. Let me tell you, the Sector 5 First Edition doesn't have blue color. It doesn't even have blue color at all, all right? So just to remind you, if you see a case, a Sector 5 case, in blue or red, other than the silver, gunmetal, or black, it must be a replica. Okay. All right. So let's see what comes with the box too. After you take this off, you get this pouch, a pouch with the element logo here. Again, this is a replica. I don't know what the real one looks like. Okay. And I believe you can just put your phone in here. Okay, to protect the aluminum from scratching. Next, it's from the box. We get this a back of screw screwdriver. 
It comes with two uh, metric screws with a keychain. It has the um, element case uh, word printed on the screwdriver. And this screwdriver, I believe it's not the original. Original one uses metal, but this one doesn't. It's a plastic. And uh, you removed it by pulling the front, and you can see it's a hexagonal shape. Okay. Next is an instruction book, um, just like the real one. Just like the real. Okay. All right. But this one, you see that it's definitely not real, cause you see uh, for the black they provide you the black strip while the white version they provide you with the silver chrome uh, shiny uh, strip for your phone edges let me tell you the real one doesn't have that the real one it's transparent and they will taps on the top and the bottom to tell you to pull it tell you how to apply it All right. next one it's it comes with another pack of um, protection within the uh, for the uh, for the aluminum edge I believe you apply it to the power button I don't know I'm not too sure maybe some kind of extra pieces so that um, you won't scratch your phone okay next it comes with the screen protector it cuts out the same way as the um, the real one all right but um, yeah, it even have the element case printed over here. Element case printed on the um, cleaning cloth. And uh, let's see. Alright, check out the cuttings. Alright. So I believe this is made in China. It's not made in um, USA. And I think I got ripped off by the, um, the seller in Mong Kok. Um, well, well, at least um, I think the best flattery it's by replicating them so this one actually caught me I didn't even know what's a an element case until I bought this alright so I think they got advertisement I paid 30 bucks for an advertisement for me to buy the real one for 150 bucks and this is the back plate tag sheet for the back plate for the iPhone. It comes in black color. I'm assuming that the real one is not like that. Okay. So I have to peel this off, okay, and then apply it at the back of my phone. Alright. And then apply the case on top. Alright. So first of all, you know do it. We have to unscrew one of the screws. For the paper case, uh, you had to unscrew two screws at least. Okay, this new design called the Sector Five, oh, we need to be unscrewed once. Okay, there's only one screw that you need to un unscrew, which is the top right corner right next to the power button the sleep and wake button and then you unscrew it okay and then you carefully insert your phone all right into the frame and uh, people might be worried about if the aluminum case will be affecting the signal issue uh, I can guarantee you that this new design okay, does not interfere the Wi-Fi signal nor the GPS signal nor the 3G or no LTE signal the reason is because the new design has 
two, no, I mean four plastic dividers or, uh, at the hinge. These transparent hinges over here, 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 and here are actually a divider and right underneath it's actually the iPhone uh, antenna divider where the white line is located at. You see that? So you don't need to worry about it too much. You can choose not to apply the back tack sheets but if you really want to apply it you can do that and it gets you the nice black finish. And you can slide your phone on table from scratching it. And let me tell you, this thing is so light that I won't even notice. Okay, I don't even notice the, the existence of this case uh, while inside my pocket. Let me tell you, I highly recommend the element case. Uh, if you have the money, go grab the um, 150 bucks, 140 bucks real case. I'm just getting this as, you know, I got tricked, I got tricked, but as you can see, you can compare the real one by watching the other videos on YouTube done by other people, and you can compare the knockoff and the real one. What's the main difference, okay? Well, again, this is Video Reborn, introducing you, revealing you the uh, knockoff uh, blue color of the element case, and thank you for watching Video Reborn over and out in Hong Kong.